everybody, this is Dave Cooper, and we are at Frameclad SFS in Midlands, England, and I am standing with Mark Munns, who's about to walk us through the entire process. Mark, where do we start? I'm a builder, I'm a developer. I say, I want to build a building. I heard you are amazing. What are we going to do, and how are you going to help me get there? Okay, so we would get your initial planning drawings or your, your design architecturally approved drawings. Our technical team would review those. They would come up with a solution that works. We would then price that if you're comfortable with the price. Then we go to the next stage, which would be to fully design the building. We design the building. The design of the building then gives us MCS data, which is the data that we require to run the machines. Okay. The machines then basically run the component that is necessary for the scheme, goes through the production line within the facility. The guys then put the panels together, they'll board them if required, they'll put a floor deck on if required, and then those get loaded onto a vehicle and taken to your job in the order that you require it. So I can come to you with my plans, my drawings that I may already have. You're going to take those drawings, you're going to digitize them, to where you can frame out the walls and, and talk to the machines that are going to print out the metal in the exact shapes that I need it, correct? Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. And so then that goes to the machines. you got your whole team in there that's actually now running the data in the machines. The machines are then actually taking the flat steel off a roll coil, running it through the Howick machine, which is then shaping it. Correct. Is that correct? Absolutely correct. Right? And then where does it go once they pull it out of the machine? I, they're stacking They'll them. They'll basically stack the panel in, in a form. They'll have an assembly drawing that goes with it. Mm -hmm. That assembly drawing makes that panel and all of its locations unique. So the guys can then have only got one way to put that panel together. Right. The panel gets assembled, stored out here, and then basically when it's ready to go to site, we uplift it and deliver it. So when it comes out, they actually stack it in an order to where the assembly line can then put it together efficiently and quickly and accurately, and then it gets stacked, like you're saying here, in the order in which they would use it on the job site, because I think that's important to talk about. You don't want just a bunch of trucks running up and this is the actual top floor and everything on, right? Yeah, yeah. You don't want it to be backwards. And so you guys actually assemble it yeah, in the order that work. the builder wants it with. Dependent on the size of the scheme, if it's, uh, we, we send a component in different ways, that's a fully assembled floor cassette yep. panel. We can send component if the site's tight mm -hmm. and they can assemble the panel on site. So we'll, we'll really mould ourselves to suit what the right. developer or builder wants. So you have a full system here is what I'm hearing, right? Because behind us we've got floor cassettes, looks like we have some wall cassettes underneath it ready to go. And then this is a finished floor cassette where they can actually screen the material on top of this for the finished floor. Is that accurate? Got it, got it. So that's amazing that all of that can be done. And typically the process from when somebody comes to you with a set of plans to the time you actually have them on production, what does that look like? Um, we can turn around a, de a design. If you were talking about a pair of semi-detached houses in four weeks, um, and then basically it'd be another four to six weeks to go through the full design MCS data and assembly process to get to site. To get to site. And, and one last question that we're not showing here is, with the wall assemblies, you can do as much or as little as the builder wants. So you can put insulation in, you can put the fire rated uh, wall material on it as well, correct? Yes. And you know, all the window openings, everything's in place, the headers are in place, that's done. That's all done, all, all pre-assembled in the factory. Yep. So basically the product when stood up will get you in the dry really, really quick. And MEPs, mechanicals, electrical, it looks like all the holes all the are already in place. Are they just got to come and run. They don't have to make a mess of the floors and cut things. And then somebody else has to sweep it up, right? Straight run through, right. all dry. Yeah, I love Takes it. Takes the weather out of the equation. Sure. It's really, really fast. And you guys are doing everything from a single family bespoke product all the way up to six floors, thousands and thousands of... We, we, we're annotated to go 10 stories high. Yeah. So we can do a building that's 10 stories high, no problem at all. I love it. Mark, thanks for having us. Thank you. I love it. You guys are doing amazing stuff. I'm Dave Cooper. We are at Frameclad SFS in Midlands, England. We'll see you next time.